those numbers, man. I, I would when love to 3%? see. One day we look at how and many that's shots. It was eight percent. It's contested because he it, everything is contested with him. He looks like a tired basketball player because normally he and CJ are constant moving. You can't keep up with him because they're just constant moving. And it makes me think this offseason with the Olympics, he didn't get a chance to train properly, get his body right because when you're that small and you shoot a lot of jump shots, you got to be in peak shape in order to score and play at that level because everything is done with your cardio and your legs. Sam, you brought up something else about Damian Lillard. Uh, when you were seeing guys that played in a bubble that overexerted themselves a little bit, then you mentioned the Olympics. Remember, Damian Lillard got hurt in the bubble just over a year ago. So when you look at the two-year span of the amount of basketball that he's been playing, I feel like he's one of those guys as well. Yeah, it's just tough, man. And, and, and this was the concern of a lot of players starting the season when they started. Going back to 82 games, it's not that the players don't want to play, but you're seeing. Look at James Harden. Look at some of these guys. They're just not right, man, and it's hard because this is two years in a row of a short offseason. Normally, Smitty, the first month after the season, you don't do anything. You just decompress and let your body heal because you need to put on 8 to 10 pounds after you've been running for 100 games. <laughs> you need to let your body fill out rest a little bit and before you start back working. These guys took a week or two off, and they were back in the gym. And then you look at teams today, they don't believe you should give players time off. They got all these player development guys, and Smitty, I'll tell you this, the more people you have on staff, it's always somebody blowing your phone up saying, yes. let's come work out, because they got to just find their job. It is, and I, and I think with all these guys, Sam said it best, they haven't got their proper rest. I mean, you look at end of the seasons, mm -hmm. especially for the Milwaukee Bucks and the Phoenix Suns, and then the guys went to, they probably got... 30 days off, that's just not enough no. for an NBA body. And I for think two right years now, of playing now. Years, it, it, it's starting to affect them. Their legs are and shoot percentage across the board is way down for, for the entire NBA. And certainly an emphasis is put on defense and the rule changes. So defensive players also a bit of an advantage being more physical this year. A lot of changes in the league.